Rain chances as we move through the next several days will be on and off, and it looks like that we will increase those rain chances to 60% on Thursday. Now, I think that will mainly be during the afternoon, going into the evening, and into Friday morning. Then it will start to decrease Friday afternoon into Saturday, but then increase again late Sunday into Monday, as we may have some thunderstorm potential by then as well. So let's check out the near term here in the next 48 hours. Clouds will be moving into the area tonight, and we may see some sprinkles as we head towards Thursday morning. This is here at 7 o'clock, but let's head out into time here going to about 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Notice things start to pick up. So afternoon evening hours is when more widespread shower activity will continue. I don't think it's going to be too terribly heavy out there, but we will see some showers from time to time. That will continue through midnight going into Friday morning as well. So those showers continuing across the area. Notice it does decrease though as we head into Friday afternoon and we will still have the clouds sticking around. So here's your 10 day forecast 53 degrees on Thursday, 60% chance for some showers out there. So it will be quite a bit cooler over the next couple of days with showers and those rain chances around. Again, the highest chance of rain will be Thursday afternoon through Friday morning. We get a little break as we head into Friday afternoon going into Saturday, about a 30% chance for a few showers and thunderstorms, but I do think it'll ramp up again Sunday afternoon going through Monday as another cold front moves in. So maybe some thunderstorms here and that could continue into Monday. Severe weather chances not all that high, but we could see a stronger storm or two Sunday afternoon as that cold front moves through. We will be tracking that for you closely. Tuesday, 60 degrees, 20% chance of an isolated shower, and then things start to calm down a bit as we head toward the middle and end of next week with temperatures getting back up into the 70s for highs and notice nothing close to freezing.